Well, would you serve your guests McDonald's at your wedding reception? McDonald's have come up with a special menu for couples who want nuggets with their nuptials. Nothing is sacred <laughs> anymore. The McDonald's package uh, features 100 chicken burgers, 100 boxes of nuggets or 100 cheeseburgers and 100 chicken fingers and it'll only set you back 350 now, I should warn, the package doesn't come with a McDonald's clown. That's because most grooms have already chosen their best man. Their slogan is making weddings unforgettable. Well, it would be <laughs> memorable, but I think for all the wrong reasons. Caleb, the thing I loved about this story was the McDonald's spokesperson pointed out that the wedding package does not include holding the actual ceremony in the McDonald's <laughs> restaurant. Well, thank you God can't for have that, everything. Because that's what the kids do for their birthday parties, right? But I reckon McDonald's should not be touched until after 2am, and I did a bit of that on the weekend. But speaking of weddings, one bride has gone online to complain that her wedding guests were so terrible they wouldn't punt up $1,600 to attend her wedding. She said, yeah. how can we have our wedding that we dreamed of without proper funding? We sacrificed so much and only asked each guest for around $1,600. My maid of honour pledged $5,000. She goes on and on and on. But she goes, our request for $1,500 for all our guests was not effing out of the ordinary. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> Is this not the most entitled bride you'd have ever heard of? I'm not paying to go to your wedding. Like, she's, she's one of these people who wants to lock people up for misgendering. <laughs> it was even worse when guests wouldn't pay. She ditched the groom. I know. And now she's single. It's all over. Done. <laughs>